Welcome to Take Cover. In this series of videos, I will try to unpack short-term insurance for you. Understanding insurance makes it easier to make decisions on what your insurance should look like. Client and broker are partners identifying risks and finding the best solution to mitigate the risk. This leads to a good claims experience. This first video, I will look at the history of insurance and how it all started. First the legalities. The purpose of this video is not to give advice. Advice follows a procedure of needs analysis and a recommendation based on the analyses that will solve an identified need. That is why you need to consult with an advisor before making changes to your financial portfolio. Obviously there is no needs analysis and hence there can be no advice. The purpose of this video is to share knowledge and insights so that you have a better understanding of insurance. A better understanding will lead to an overall better insurance experience. Please subscribe to my channel to be notified of future videos, also like and share the video, if you found it valuable. Now let's get back to our topic. Insurance is a system of spreading the risk of one, onto the shoulders of many. A shared burden, is a lighter burden. In the description below, I will put a link to detailed articles on the history of insurance. To keep the video short, I stick to what I learned when I joined the industry 25 years ago. Insurance has a long history. Even the camel traders of Babylon had some form of insurance, called bottomry. It dates to 4000 BCE. The merchandise was financed. In the event the merchandise was lost, the loan was cancelled. The interest was considered an insurance premium. When sailors like Columbus, Diaz, and others started circumnavigating the earth in the 15th century, the financial risk became very high. The ships were expensive and one needed capital to build it. The cargo was equally valuable. Imagine a shipwreck at the Cape of Storms and ship and cargo is lost. A huge financial setback for everybody. Short-term insurance played a major role in the financial progress of the world. I often wonder how much wealth there would be without insurance. The first form of insurance, was to spread the cargo over many ships. That way, if one ship was lost, the owners would not lose their whole investment in the cargo as well. That was the first instance of shared burden. There was a coffee shop in London, Lloyd's, where all the merchants would meet. It became a clearinghouse for information. Who is sailing where, who has cargo to ship or who has capacity to ship some more cargo. In time wealthy merchants saw an opportunity to insure a ship and cargo at a premium. This was a better option than the spread cargo option, modern insurance was born. Some ships and cargo will be lost, the insurer would pay the agreed amount of the claim, but, if premiums were more than the claims, there was an underwriting profit and reserves accumulated. Insurance became a business and industry. The principle is still the same, risk shared over many ships or shoulders. In modern times, the risk is spread between clients, insurers and reinsurance companies, to ensure the system can carry the load. Furthermore, it makes sense to also spread the risk over a wide geographical region, and diverse industries. To understand this, imagine all the clients live in a hurricane-prone area. Then the risk is not spread well and too many simultaneous claims can hurt the system, or premiums would be too high. It is the nature of insurance, that if one hurts, everybody hurts. The worst conceivable thing is an insurance company going bankrupt. For insurance to work, every stakeholder must play his or her role responsibly, the insured premium payer must pay his premium, and not try to get an advantage over other insureds, the insurers must underwrite the risk properly to ensure that they operate profitably, reinsurers must underwrite their risk properly to ensure the integrity of the whole system. Risk must be spread over a variety of clients over a big geographical area to protect against natural disasters, such as hurricanes. It makes sense to spread the risk over diverse industries. Actuarial science ensures that one industry or region do not subsidize another. And that is the history and principles of the wonderful product called, insurance. Please leave comments below. You are welcome to post short-term insurance related questions as well. Please subscribe, and ring the bell below to be notified when I upload the next video. Hit the like button, if the video added some value to you. Remember to check out the links in the description below.